So it seems a lot of people have watched the video I did where I gave out, where I spoke about some of the regrets I had of university. So because it got so much attention and so much love, I just thought it would make sense to kind of just do a whole section on university and university advice because university was a big part of my life and it is it was one of the best times of my life as well. And if I can impart some of my knowledge, then I am going to do that. So this video is basically gonna be about how to be a fresher. If you guys are not down with the university lingo, being a fresher means your first year of university. Before you go to university, university is like such a big thing. It's like, oh damn, I'm working towards a degree right now. Like, this is gonna be intense. And then you get to uni and it's kind of like, hang on, there are, out, there are people out getting wasted and drunk. I thought it would be like a bunch of nerds walking around and it's really not. University, being at university is kind of like its own little world and you do get some of the nerds, but you also get to see those people like, how the hell did you make it to university? First thing first, you're not going to be a bunch of, well you might be some nerds, but university is not teeming with, with nerds. Like, it's just not. My time as a fresher, like being a fresher is probably going to be the calmest time at university. So first things first, all I'm going to say is that you need like just enjoy it. Just enjoy the experience, enjoy being in a new environment. Just do as much as you can in your first year of university because it is going to, the workload is going to get, it's going to keep on increasing, increasing, increasing as you go along. So especially like during freshers week and during like the first few months to try and get out there, try and, you know, explore, explore like the new city you're in or whatever. And it's like really, really find out what the university has to offer. This is going to be more tailored towards people that move out to go uni rather than people who commute. Um, just, cause that, just because that's my experience, like I moved out. So one of the moments, like one of the biggest moments for me during my time with the fresher was when you get to your new room, you unpack all your stuff and then your parents are like, okay, we're leaving now. And then you see them drive off into the sunset and you're just in your room and the question that comes to your head is, what now? And that is totally normal. You're, you're gonna have that question. You're gonna be in your room, you're gonna be like, damn, like I've made it, but like, what do I do now? I say at that moment in time, I will say, just stay in your room, just get used to what's going on and just like acclimatize yourself to your new surroundings. But also another thing to do is meet your housemates, meet your flatmates, meet whoever you're living with because you're going to be living with them for like a whole year. It's, it's a time to gauge which ones of your flatmates you like and which ones you don't like because I'm sorry but you're not going to like everyone you live with. Those first few weeks are time to figure out who these people are and who you're going to spend most of your time with. In terms of the academic side, being a fresher, like I said, is really, really, it's, it's straightforward because university is nothing like school. Um, there's much more independent study. So you're just kind of trying to get used to kind of like how university works, how you go about revising, how about how lectures go, how tutoring goes and all that kind of stuff. And it is a bit overwhelming at first, but you do like pick it up pretty, pretty quickly. And also the good thing about university is that you're most likely doing a subject that you're really, really interested in. So you're bound to be a bit more like focused, a bit more into it than you were like at school you're just doing like citizenship or stuff you didn't care about. Take everything as, as it comes, don't get too overwhelmed by it. Like I said, and first year doesn't, like we all say, first year doesn't really count, but still like keep focus. Remember you're there to get a degree, you're not there to like party and whatever. That comes later. I remember also that university is a good time because you're not at home anymore, you've moved to a completely different place. So some people kind of like to, it's a chance for you to try try new things. I don't want to say become a different person, but you know what I mean? Like go out there, push yourself out there, like try and push your boundaries. Just do stuff that you haven't had opportunity to do before. Um, you're kind of like your own person at university, like you've got so much independence. Go out there and just do as, as much as you can because it, it does go really, really fast. Before you know it, you're going to be going to second year and figuring out like where the hell did the time go. Another thing about being a fresher is, I don't know how most unis work, but the way my uni worked was that only freshers got calls. So about halfway through first year, you should be looking for somewhere to live in your second year. Find the people you want to live with and get looking for those houses. Like around Christmas time, just after Christmas, that's when you should really be looking for a place to live in your second year. Uh, I mean, it's not the end of the world if you don't find somewhere, but I mean, if you don't find somewhere like around that time, but just to get it sorted out of the way. And plus like agency fees are, are pretty ridiculous. So you don't want to be thinking, oh yeah, I have all this money. And then you realize actually I have no money because I need to pay 
all the state agents, these mad fees, I don't even know what they're going towards. And yeah, just enjoy it, make friends, embrace it as much as you can. Obviously, all everyone's uni university experience is going to be different, no one's university experience is going to be the same. So I'm just telling you, like, this is based on my experience, so you might have a totally different experience to me which again is totally fine. You can never really be prepared, you can read all the forms you want, you can read all the booklets you want, but you're never really gonna be prepared about what university has to offer you. So go into it with an open mind and a desire to learn new things, whether that's academically or personally. But yeah, thank you for everyone that watched the other video. I didn't realize that many people would watch it. I don't know why so many people are watching it, it's just like me babbling for about eight minutes about nothing really, but I mean, give the people what they want right please 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 like and subscribe i'm still i haven't even broken 20 subscribers yet which is pretty abysmal so it would mean a lot to me if you do subscribe and peace